Hello guys, it's Jax here. Welcome back to the video. Today we're going to be doing another minute script tutorial and in so this video I'm going to show you how to create a simple item editor to change the name of an item, change the lore of an item, and to disenchant an item if you want to. And so this script is pretty simple so I'm going to show you what it does real quick. So you can do item editor and then name and then choose the name. So I'm going to do like, you can use colors too. You can use the color symbols and be hey. So now it's named hey. And then we can do the same thing but with the lore and you can do any lore you want and then you can do an extra line by doing these two lines that <laughs> that was kind of repetitive but there we go see we got we got the lore and then i can also do slash item editor clear enchants and it disenchants the item so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to set up the, the command real quick so command slash item editor and of course you can choose whatever name you want for the command doesn't really matter and then we gotta set the first variable which will be text and then a second text variable which will be an optional text variable. So if you leave it blank, then it would basically just not set a lore or a name. And basically these square brackets right here make it so you don't have to put that variable in, but you have to put the first variable in. And so now that we got the command, we can go down and we can set a permission for it because we don't want just anyone to be able to, you know, use <laughs> these commands since they're kind of operator commands, if you know what I'm saying. And then we can do the trigger and then if arg1, is name so if the the first thing is name this first variable right here is name then we're going to edit the name of course i mean that's what we want so we want to set the name of players held item to colored arg2 and that will allow you to use color codes in your script so now that we got the name sorted we can come down here and then we can do the next part so uh we, we go over here do if arg Oh gosh, I can't type. If arc2 is lore, then we're going to be setting the lore. And so we can just copy this real quick, paste it down here, and then just set lore. And that that's all you have to do. The, the lore thing is set. And then we can go down again. Oh, I messed up. This is be arc1. Sorry about that. We can go down here. If arg1 is clear and chance. And you can name any like you can make the commands whatever name you want it doesn't really matter but we have this and then we can go over here and then it's just this enchant the players tool and that's all you have to do for the clear enchants and so you have your script done you can go back into the game and it should work if you have any suggestions for any future script tutorials leave them in the link below and if you want to check this, if you want to just download this script instead of typing out like the five lines, then you can see the link in the description. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.